What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Chaos. My name is Lad the Tech, and today I'm in a bit of a spooky mood, as you can tell. I'm wearing my little cardigan with this nice little hood on it, and honestly, I think it looks badass on me. I was wearing my ghost face shirt because we are playing a spooky game. It has this tradition around here. I guess for Adam Flair, I could actually be holding one of these candles. It's a wireless candle, so uh, it's an LED candle, so it's you get it right. One game that is recently released is the remake of Silent Hill 2. Now, I would be playing that game. But I've never even played the first one. And we're going to correct that by playing this, the original Silent Hill. I'm just going to put this about on my head, and that should hold things right where I need to be. Now, it is going to be a little bit odd because I am playing on an emulator, so not everything's going to be perfect, but it is what it is. Also, if you like this content, you should subscribe and uh, become a channel member and all that stuff. Become a member of my meme cult and, uh, you know, pay your tithe because it helps out the channel a lot. Or just turn on bell notifications, all that stuff, you know, you know. Do the things you need to do to support the channel. If you want to see me play more of this, let me know in the comment section. And with that, let's get into the game. Normal. Oh. That sounded threatening. It right, looks like I was passed out drunk in a car. So it's just a normal Tuesday for me. Okay. Well. Okay, there we go. Okay. Do I remember how I got here? Oh. Interesting. Now, there are a couple things I do know about Silent Hill. First off is that the render distance. Oh, Cheryl, where could you be? Yes, Cheryl. It's strange. Indeed. It's quiet. Too quiet. This place is like a ghost town. That is like foreshadowing. All right, let's get a hang of the controls. Yeah, I know that. Oh, yep. And it's, it's literally just turn camera and then footsteps okay thank you all right yeah I remember that like with the way the graphics were set up in this game because the uh, hardware at the time couldn't handle it like it couldn't render that far for, in front of it so Cheryl? so they Is used that Cheryl mm, could be Nah. look at the way her arms move definitely a Sasquatch where are you going Away from you, you're a bad parent. Hey, wait! Stop! Cheryl! How do I run? Can I run? Oh, yep, I can. Alright, so she ran in this direction. Yeah, the volumetric fog is just there to kind of hide the fact that the uh, processors and stuff on the early PlayStation couldn't actually keep up with the draw distance. Okay, she went... She, she didn't go that way. She went... Why did you... Oh my god. Oh my god. The controls are so jank. Beware of Doge. Okay. I can't believe my guy just rent. That's not going to be a problem for me. Oh my god. Like, like I, I, I was saying, like, the controls are, like, super jank. I'm so... Yeah, this is... These are very Resident Evil-esque controls. Like... Oh, wow. Okay, I'm... I hope I don't get in a chase over here, because I will die. Uh-huh. Just gotta run into everything. There we go. I'm starting to get a hang of it. That's strange. It's getting dark. Yeah. We call that nighttime. Better than nothing, I guess. Um... Not so sure about that. Oh. Oh, wow, that's a very squeaky wheel. You need to get that greased, man. As the old saying goes. Why is the... Oh, the blood, of course. I'm just so used to playing horror games and seeing blood is like... Eh. Oh my god. It's just getting worse and worse as we go on. Are you Cheryl? What is this? What's going on here? Um, I don't know, but maybe you don't. St oh, oh, children with knives. Children with. Oh God. Ah, gosh. Nope. You don't have the map. Okay, yeah, I noticed. That was a quick death. Well, thank you all for watching. If you this is your first time, let me know in the comment section. All right, we're back at the hospital. It's fine. 
Was that supposed to happen? Hello. Here's the cop in Dead by Daylight that looks like the Grinch. Was I dreaming? How do you feel? It's like I was dreaming. Oh, like I've been run over by a truck. That's from all the drinking, man. I'm all right, I guess. Glad to hear it. You from around here? Does it look he like I am? Me what happened. I don't have to tell Wait you anything. Second, I'm, just I'm not speaking tourist. to you without my lawyer. I came here for a vacation. I just got here. Uh huh. I don't know what happened. You blacked out in your truck. I'd like to find out myself. Uh huh. <laughs> Even she doesn't believe have me. Have you seen a little girl? Just turned seven last month. Short, black hair. My daughter. Sorry. As opposed to somebody else's daughter. The only person I've seen in this town is you. Oh. Where is everybody? I'd tell you if I knew, believe me. Yeah, that doesn't seem to be a problem. From what I can tell, something bizarre is going on. You can't say. You don't say. Hmm. What's your name? Uh, very Harry. fucking confused. Harry Mason. Hi, Harry. Sybil Bennett. Okay. I'm a police officer from Brams, the next town over. So the what are you doing are here? Dead, and the radio too. I'm going back to call in some reinforcements. No, no, no. You stay here. I need cannon fodder. Hold it. Where do you think you're going? Well, I'm not detained, am My I? My daughter. I've got to find her. No way. No way. It's dangerous out there. Do you know more than you're letting on? In that on? case, I need to find her now. Cheryl's my little girl. How's she gonna be in Dead by Daylight if I don't save her? Have you got a gun? Not yet. Um, no. Take this, and hope you don't have to use it. I feel like I'm gonna have to use now that. Now listen to me. Before you pull the trigger, know who you're shooting. Mm-hmm. And don't do it unless you have to. And mm -hmm. don't go blasting me by mistake. I feel like I'm gonna Got it? fail <laughs> at that. Yeah. Thanks. You do best to stay nearby. I'll be back with help as quick as I can. Excellent. Thanks. So what if I just waited here the entire time? You know, with the janky controls. Alright. My natural instinct is to try... What was that? Radio. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that she did say all the radios were broken. Uh, knife? Kitchen knife. Take it? Yes. Uh, health drink. Yes, take that. That's why you investigate everything in a game. Flashlight? Yep, take that. And what is... Someday someone may experience these bizarre events. Hopefully they will find these notes useful. Oh, all right. Now we need to go outside and do something. Maybe I should check for something useful before leaving. Haven't I already done that? I found a couple useful things. We got a broken radio. Um, got some notes. What about? Oh, is this the map? Oh, all right, excellent. Okay. Oh, oh, there was something outside. I saw that. All right, so we're there. Um, we want to go. Honestly, I have no idea where I'm going. Midwich Elementary School. Huh? What's that? Huh. Radio. What's going on with that radio? Oh, nothing. It's just here to get you in trouble. See? Cool. How do I use a gun? Oh, shit. I'm just casually walking out. No, oh, I got to beat that monster. You beat it by getting away from it. Alright, how do I... Alright, excellent. This is not a dream. What's happening to this place? Who knows? I also forgot there are L and R bot. Maybe may be useful for something. I... That thing just almost got us killed. Pocket radio, take it. Yeah, for some reason. It also has very old school Resident Evil S controls that are kind of jank. Where could Cheryl have gone? I told you. I guess I'll check that alley again. 
Uh, she's obviously in Midwich. Okay, so... I hate how very much jank the controls are. Oh. Oh, run! Oh, shit. I'm just gonna continue to run. Okay, so that's what the radio does. Okay, so it's that way. Alright, we're in the alley again. Okay, nope. Oh, shit. Bang, bang. Ah, shit. And now there's a new dog. And we leave that shit behind. Alright, excellent. Into the janky fucking alleyway. Alright, we are in close quarters, so maybe I can get away with using a knife, right? Ooh. Hang on ammo. Thank you. We're just going to reload. I'm not equipping it just yet. Oh wait, there's some trash here. Steel pipe ticket, yeah sure. I'm assuming I just have an unlimited amount of inventory to school. Isn't the Cheryl sketchbook? Hmm, she's at the school. Hmm, the school, huh? You know, the exact same place I told you to go to earlier. This picture, it's me. The first picture that Cheryl drew in the sketchbook that I gave her, that I gave on her fifth birthday. Okay, yeah. Interesting. Okay, I don't want to go face the dogs with just a knife to defend myself. So I'm just going to keep pressing on this way. Oh, did I just go backwards? I think I did. Just stab the dog. Okay, yeah, well, I'm gonna die here. Okay, great news. Right out of that fucking alleyway. Okay, we go to the end of the street and then we take it left. Okay, never mind. We take it right. All right, is it possible to just go down this way, then hang a left? Apparently not. What is this? Doghouse. Wow. Doghouse, 11th Street. What does that mean? Okay. So we head back the way we came. We head this direction. I head in the right direction. I have to check because honestly, it's hard to fucking tell. We walk in the middle of the street like a madman. And there's another down street. Honestly, me running from my problems is probably the worst part of this game right now. I probably don't want to go that way, do I? Yeah, no. I'm just gonna quietly back up and out of that. Okay, so... All the routes to Midwich seem to be blocked, which may lead leave us with only one option, and that's taking some of those alleys. I'm just gonna go ahead and take this one. I hear you. Yep. All right, excellent. This alleyway goes nowhere, but we do have ammunition. Yeah, it still goes off even though the pterodactyl's dead. There we go. Okay, so I think our best bet, I don't know. Let's hang it right here and kind of confirm my suspicion. Where'd he go? Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Got a wily one here. Okay, there we go. 
Great news, he's dead. All right. So with literally every path to Midwich gone, and all we have is just Doghouse on 11th Street. Can I zoom into this at all? It said something about Doghouse on 11th... Oh, 11th Street. 11th Street. Doghouse. Okay, yeah, we go there. Is this 11th Street? No. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, we dodged him. Narrowly, but we dodged him. All right, stop sign, which typically means, yeah. So we're looking for a doghouse. What that could mean, I could not tell you. The house with all the dogs in front of it? Oh, gosh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. No. Am I taking damage whenever he does that? No. Okay, good. It's a doghouse. Can I read these? Okay, I'm willing to bet one of these houses open up, right? Just kind of feel that door real quick. Okay, this mailbox is torn down. Does that mean anything? Still no. Okay, it's a doghouse Levin Street. Okay, um, maybe looking for an actual doghouse. I know, novel concept. Or a house with a bunch of dogs in front of it. Wait a minute, is it referring to the alley? Nope. Yeah. I'm fairly certain as long as I'm shooting those things, it doesn't matter. Okay, hang on. This house. Well, there's a dog house. There's a dog there. Okay, what is this? House key hidden in the dog house. Take it. Yeah. All right, are they going to get back up? Also, what does... Oh, well. <laughs> Never mind, I figured it out. There's first aid kit. Take it. Yep, sure. I guess since I have that, I'm going to use a health potion. Wait, what is the difference? Modern amount of stamina. Supplies nutrition to recover a small amount of health. Yeah. Okay, we're just going to go ahead and use that. Just willy nilly use it. It's like, can I open these doors? It's locked. Never mind. Although he backs up, he kind of sticks his butt out. Hang on. It's like, <laughs> looks like he's going to twerk. Ooh, another health potion. Excellent. Don't mind if I do. Can I raid the fridge? The fridge is empty. What kind of house has an empty fridge? Wait, 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 wait. Map. Keys for Eclipse. Something is written on the map, hanging on the wall. Copied to map. Right, excellent. Okay, so something about... Let's see. No? So this right here, this alley, is important. And so is this, for some reason? I couldn't tell you what any of this means. All right, so let's reconvene back at the cafe and save, or maybe I can go through. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I'm actually going to save right now. Nothing useful. All right, so doghouse was riveting. Okay, so we can probably go to Madison Street, which is this way. And I think this is one of those games where enemies don't really respawn. Just judging by the way, like, None of the enemies that I killed so far have respawned. So I'm actually going to check the spot by the circle. For oh my god. If I just keep running, I'll be all right, right? All right, and I think it was over here on the right. Unless my math is really bad. Nope, it's over here. It's over here on the right. So 
so it's something about this spot in particular. Ah, yes, the fire hydrant. What's that say? No trespassing. What the? Why did I just do a little skip and a hop there? Is there a way I can... I don't know. Oh! Okay. Okay, interesting. Alright, so there's one key. So we have two more and they're going to be in that alleyway. Luckily, Cheryl has Soul Guard, so that should help out a lot. Should be an alleyway over here somewhere. And probably an enemy in the alleyway. I can imagine. <laughs> in this alleyway. That I'm just casually walking down. I'm very much looking like the first time haunted house goer right now. Okay. Off limits, you say. Well, not gonna stop me. Okay, well that doesn't help me much. So this is the pack. No, turn, turn, turn. Yes. Alright. Oh, that was blood. Hang on. Oh. Well, excellent. I can now see why this was off limits. So, I'm going to pick up this first. I'm going to pick up this second. Okay, I was barely certain there was going to be like a jump scare or something like that. Alright. So that means we have one more key to find. Oh. Guy's there. You! Yeah, I'm just going to fire randomly into the... Nope. Okay, excellent. Alright, well, he's dead now. So if I were another key, where would I be? So. I don't know, guys. <laughs> so I did see the arrow over here. I wonder if that leads to a key. Yeah, the way out's going to be blocked. Or is it? Oh. Hey, hello. Alright. Oh! There's bullets. And a key. Okay, yeah, so there was something there. Excellent. Key of the lion, yes. So we got the lion, the witch, and the wardrobe. So now we just gotta go back to the doghouse. Everything's going according to plan. What plan? Exactly. Yeah, my radio's just going off like crazy, and I'm just like... <laughs> I'm just ignoring it. Oh, God! Right, well, I guess I have to kill it now. Special senses. Don't be a little bitch. Face me! Oh. Uh, 11th Street. <laughs> and this little crackhead bird wants a piece of me. Shot it right in the ass. Luckily, it's headed in the right direction. I love how this is supposed to be a horror game, and I'm basically treating it like duck, duck hunt. Alright. Calm down, dude. Jesus. Sorry, my guy just gave up smoking. Nothing useful. The, the, what do you mean? There! God. We should just be able to... Use key of the lion. Use key of the woodman. Use key of the scarecrow. It's unlocked. Hooray. What? Oh, great. It's getting dark again. Yeah, what's going on? Oh. Well, death, that's what's going on. Alright, excellent. So, we have a completely full clip now. Okay. So... Okay, yeah. Obvious boss, imminent boss battle is obvious. Okay, so we are full health right now, so I'm not too worried about that. Okay. So far. Um, so creepy. And yes, I immediately walked towards the side. Okay. If we're to believe that this lie is true, we're going to go this way. Okay, well, that's not good. Okay, and murder him. Turn. 
Right up. We're gonna follow him. Or not. Never mind. And there he is again. I'm assuming he's just gonna keep doing that. Wrong dog. Okay, yeah, I was stuck in animation that time. Yeah, I hate how they just stay there on the floor. I also hate how I got hit twice. But we're still good. Yeah, the dogs are still growling even though they're dead. Oh. Oh. Nope. Come here, fucker. Okay. That's enough of that. Oh, the music's getting way more ominous now. I think we're going the right way. Yep, that's the right way. It's behind me, isn't it? Oh, yep, you son of a bitch. That's enough of you. Wait, have I been missing an opportunity to collect stuff off of these corpses? Oh, but I can step on them. Yeah, it might be. All right, so that's fine. Okay. Boom. You just got shot, and it's just like, yeah, whatever, man. Pete is gonna be upset with me. Stopped a minute animation. Nice. And now we step on his butt. And that's enough of him. Stop? Okay, yeah, sure. Why not? Alright, Midwitch should be on my right. Oh, yep, the ominous music confirms it. Alright, and we have another dog. Oh, two dogs. What the? Oh, I thought you were dead, you little bastard. Come here, let me get that to stop. Stop! Get rid of that annoyingness. Oh yeah, this button. There we go. Alright. Midwitch. Now what? Ah, yes. I'm gonna just stare directly into the light. What's the worst that could happen? Okay, well. Um. Oh, there's blood everywhere, so that's not a good thing. More Randall Gordon, this must be a list of the teachers. All right, well, that's not useful to us, is it? All right, this is usually where survivors tend to get lost the most. It's written in blood. 10, <laughs> 10 o'clock, Alchemy Laboratory. Gold in an old man's palm. The future is hidden in his fist. Exchange for sage is water. What? <laughs> it's written in blood. The darkness that brings the cloak, the choking heat. Flames turn to the sunshine. Okay, yeah, whatever. Okay, so that has to do with the damn clock. Got it. It's written in blood. Okay, yeah, I'm not gonna read any of that. Okay. Great looping spot, honestly. Oh, never mind. It's a little bit more rundown than normal. Okay, that would be the courtyard out there, if I remember correctly. The only reason why I know any of this is because I... Oh, hey, there we go. It's because I play a lot of Dead by Daylight. Taking a first aid kit here. Oh, hell yeah. Health drink. Uh, We got six of those. Might as well use one, right? I think I've been doing this long enough, so I'm going to actually save my game now. And I will see you guys next time. So far, I'm having a blast. This game is awesome. I can't believe it's taken me all these years to play it. Let me know what you guys think of it in the comment section down below or over on a Discord, which will be linked in the description. Um, I would like to play the full game, but it just kind of depends on how many views we get. So if you guys really like this, subscribe, turn on bell notifications, you know, leave leave something in the comment section. Let me know that you guys actually want more of this. And uh, if you want to help support the channel, become a channel member and uh, send me likes and stuff in the form of a super thanks. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed it, feel free to show me some love down below by hitting the like button. And don't forget to check out the annotations for more videos. Now I'll see you in the next video.